and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. And already we're underway here. And it's played forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Forward it goes. Hoists it forward. Ellie attempts a clearance. Difficult to choose between them early on. Not many chances yet. Just brushed off the ball there. A real chance to break. Fischer. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are... Lucas Perez! It's in! All over in seconds. That's what they can do to you. Well, talking about being hit on the break, the ball was in their net before they could even organise their defence. It was fast and furious and all but unstoppable. <laughs> A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Yeah, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. It's being played forward. Looking to hit the front line. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And it's played forward. And that's been levered clear. Forward it goes. And it's got through. So who's he picking out? Cut out in the nick of time. Tries to get it forward quickly. Played out to the right. Goes long. Gets it, and now what? That was a good run. The defence looked beaten there. And that's been won straight back. Gorgeous control there. Here comes another cross. Knocks it away. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. 
pumps it into the area. Ellie is there, and he can get that clear. Turns and goes back. And the referee brings the first half to a close. So there you have it, a close fought half of football, but one that still had its moments, and ultimately produced just one goal. More than a decent game up to now. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. So we're just settling back into this second half. Juba Champu don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. Hoists it forward. And he's there to clear it. Lucas Perez did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Cuts it out. Played in with accuracy. And well played, he saw that coming. Ellie. Goes direct to the front line. And it's played forward. Done very well to intervene. Forward it goes. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Tries to get it forward quickly. That'll be a throw. And it's Fischer. Plays it out to the flank. A really good feat from him. Looking for a decent ball in. Big chance! <laughs> the message is clear. None shall pass. And it's played forward. Gets it back. Lucas, it's Lucas Perez! <laughs> Hoists it forward, well positioned to make that interception. And in the end, they found themselves penned in, nowhere to go. Juba Champu are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Forward it goes. Pulls loose, who's getting there? Hossalu. Vidal. The final five minutes. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. And here's Lucas Perez. And that's been leave it clear. Yeah, he's fouled him there. And the referee brings it to a close. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? It's just a bad day at the office, Peter. They look below par in all areas.